Hey guys, I'm LB, and before we check out Seven by Demon Arisen, I just wanna I wanna make note of something. Cube prominently featured in thumbnail on a button. Cube prominently featured in thumbnail on a button. Cube prominently featured in thumbnail. Button prominently featured in thumbnail. Cube prominently featured in thumbnail. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm sensing a pattern here. Granted, it's not a bad pattern. It's just a pattern. <laughs> Anyway, let's continue on with Seven by Demon Arisen. Cave Johansson here. Since us Germans just won World War Seven, we thought we'd take over Aperture Science and put it to good use. I hear there is plenty of useful equipment here to fight off the remaining Mantis Men invaders. Cave Johansson, we're done here. I don't really know how to do a voice for an alternate cave, but like in in the in all the voice clips, the alternate caves have mostly the same voice, sometimes different. Little Timmy was different for sure, because that wasn't Cave Johnson, but whatever. In 7, you must bypass 7 Fizzlers to bring both cubes to the exit. Difficulty, medium to hard, will vary based on experience. Okay, and uh, yeah. I'm trying to figure out what this is supposed to mean. Like, that's pretty much true of every map ever. <laughs> that's not saying anything. Music by Harry Culligan. Alright, let's get started. I'm recording this a bit late today because I had stuff to do yesterday, and I couldn't record, and then I had to sleep, and... Yeah. So that's why this video is late today. Let's just go ahead and put that there, because why not? Oh my goodness. This is... This is... I feel like I'm playing the Talos Principle all over again. I'm sure those of you who have played the Talos Principle r will recognize this quite easily. Will understand what I'm talking about at least. So that's the first one. <laughs> ha. All right. So it seems like to start with we can do this, right? Yeah. What does this do? This last one. I wonder why that's inset. Interesting. <coughs> Next we get... a regular cube. Good, we can differentiate them. That is appreciated. Now what? I could just do this. We have to go back before we can go forward, I think. So there's that. Here we go. So now... We want to swap the cubes, if possible. Although, how are we gonna pull that off? I see. I see. I need to take this one first, put it here. There we go. And I can take this one and put it here. There we go. Then we can do this. Actually, don't need to do that. Uh Well, darn. Because we definitely need this fizzler to be disabled. How do I get this to come any further along this line now?
can't really do anything like this. That's not helpful at all. Cleverly designed area. One way... one way travel. And there's definitely... keep throwing is definitely right out. It's completely unintended. I'm certain of that. So well, when this is disabled, we'll also want to do this. Right. This lets us get to the exit while keeping portals. But then what? We could do that with the regular cube here, then we could recall it. How do we get the companion cube in here? And have I already messed up, is the question. Oh, duh. Like this. Except not like this at all. Yeah, never mind. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, this is not help. Not helping at all. At least that disables more fizzlers, though. Maybe we don't need a cube on there just yet. In which case... We can recall it for now, we can put it on there later. I think we want to be able to have a portal to the button from here, is what we want. I think... I think this is what we want. I will save, and we will continue. Let's see, if we call back this guy... Then we can swap him out here. Ah yes, here we go, this is exactly right. There we go. Now that's taken care of. Excellent. This is, like, the rawest fizzle pu Fizzler puzzle you could get. Like, this is just raw Fizzler logic. Alright, so next up... We can easily recall that guy whenever we want. So I think we should put this up here. I'm sure that's okay and not unintended. Do this. How did I want to do this again? Like like this somehow? Oh, I've already done it. Yeah, I think I've already done it. Uh, except, hang on a minute. 
yeah, we're, we're past the one where we need that cube for it, so... Yeah, we're good. I think we're good. Give me this. We'll swap them out. That was a double cube swap. Although, different buttons, of course. Yeah, there we go. There you have it. Ta-da! Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!